And Seattle is known for tech innovation. A lot of people know that. And now a local theater is using technology to make the theater <coughs> accessible to the deaf and hard of hearing. Yeah, Seattle's ACT Theater is leading the industry when it comes to this brand new one-of-a-kind system that's really inspiring theaters worldwide to kind of join a board and get this technology. It's also inspiring a local community to enjoy the theater like they've never been able to before. Look at this. A quiet night at the theater will always be quiet for some. The dialogue fleeting, drama minimized for the deaf and hard of hearing. But Seattle's ACT Theater is changing the game. What's so bad about that? So bad about that? Thanks to their latest production, Tribes, a coming of age story about a young deaf man. And we wanted to be accessible, fully accessible to audiences to come and enjoy the show, which means they need to be able to understand the dialogue. For over two years, the theater group has been looking for a way to add closed captioning to their productions without out, much success. We were even hanging the um, the script from the the lighting grid, and but people really had to look up and down. It just wasn't really satisfying to our deaf and hard of hearing audience. Just in time, Act Management was introduced to the Figaro system, iPads that display the words and actions of the script in time. Normally, with the Figaro system, they would mount the screens to the back of the seats in front of the patrons. In our house, that means that it's at the, the, the person's knees. So we needed to bring that screen up so that it's just below eye level as they're looking at the stage. The theaters at ACT aren't just your run-of-the-mill variety, so the different shapes and sizes presented its own challenge. Operations had to design this contraption, a casing with flexible arms that slides right onto the armrest, making every seat in the house closed captioning capable. It's been a, pr a pretty big scramble in bringing a lot of uh, various departments within the company in, into the project. The scramble and the $60,000 price tag collected almost entirely of donations and grants paid off. The state-of-the-art fix is a breeze for patrons wanting to use the system. So right here, I can see everything on the stage and the screen is right in front of me. I really don't have to move my head at all. A control station on the balcony controls the system with someone advancing the script. And if you're concerned about the brightness of the screen, don't. A special filter keeps it from annoying your neighbors. It's great for all ages. The closed caption system at ACT, removing a barrier and proving yet again, theater truly is about inclusion. I had a patron the other night um, uh, who's 90 years old saying, I can come back to theater again. I've stopped going because I can't hear what's happening in the dialogue. So we're just thrilled um, to be able to offer this and so people don't miss a word of the show. So the system, if you want to use it or you know somebody that does, it costs you nothing to use and it's gotten a great review thus far from the deaf community and the hard of hearing. Uh, in one night, they passed out 29 of these tablets. So people wow, really are using boy. them. Um, and I love what she said at the end there. It's not just for the hard of hearing, but right. it, I mean, or right. the deaf, I should say, it's also for the hard of hearing because elderly people who can't hear sure, necessarily sure. that much, you know, they've given yeah. up on the theater and now this opens up a whole new world for them. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's just like you're watching, mm -hmm. I don't know, a movie, I guess, or a, on your TV. The exactly. setup works right there. It's perfect. With closed captioning. Yeah, so doing story. some great stuff. Yeah, absolutely. Great story.